I'm Ethan from Ichiban Engineering and ISM here and we finally got the billet bearing housing in front of us. We're gonna assemble it right now. Come. This is the center core. This is the sleeve. It's a triple ball bearing. We start with inserting this. There's two bearings on the exo side and one bearing on the compressor side. It's gonna be inserted just like this. I'm gonna align for the pin. And we got a very small pin here. Go like this and locks the bearing. And then this plate comes on top. So we're gonna align it. And I'm gonna lock the bolts. This is just a demonstration. We're gonna do the final assembly in a couple of weeks. Currently waiting on some oil rings and seals. What I want to show you before we assemble this, if you come here, this is an OEM Garrett uh, bearing has in cast iron. This without the bearings weighs just over one kilo. No bearings, it's an empty cartridge. This is with the bearings, with the bolts, with everything, 885 gram. This thing with the bearings will probably be around 1.4 kilos. We got the heat shield plate. It's gonna be placed here. So we put the heat shield. This is a billet heat shield, not like their normal uh, plate that uh, comes on the garret. I'm gonna insert this just like that. Everything sits. You can see it spins super smoothly. Then we got the compressor. It's just like this, and the locking nut. And of course, this needs to be balanced after. We're gonna torque it. Okay, now it's locked. It spins freely. And we got the complete unit here. Triple ball bearing. You got the restrictor built in, so you don't really need to put a restrictor, even if you mistake, that's already sorted. You got the massive water ports here, triple or, or four time more than Garrett. And you got a return which connects directly to an AN10 fitting, so you don't need the bolts, seals perfectly. So we got a 3D print here. We got a finished product right here. It took us about a year uh, to come from the design, the idea, uh, to the finished product that you see here. All the tolerances are really tough, and this thing has to be perfectly machined. Uh, we will continue, and um, we will have these available for our turbos, obviously all our turbos. Um, we will also offer these as upgrades. So you got a Garrett GDX Gen 2, got a Garrett G series turbo, you got a precision turbo. Uh, we will offer these billet cores to go along with your turbo. So you want to upgrade your existing unit and keeping your housings, you can purchase, you will be able to purchase these uh, and basically upgrade uh, your cast iron unit either Precision or Garrett, we're working on all of the, of, of the models right now. And later on, we'll also offer these for Mitsubishi uh, TD series as well. Thank you for watching.